All right, so some things that we're going to talk about today are goals of the free market system, which is economic freedom, voluntary exchange, private property rights, profit motive, and competition. Economic freedom. People are free to secure and protect the resources without government intervention and or economic authority. Voluntary exchange. An act between buyers and sellers where both parties freely and willingly choose to take part in a market transaction. Private property rights. Tangible and intangible things owned by individuals or firms over which their owners have exclusive and absolute legal rights, such as land, buildings, money, copyrights, and patents, etc. Profit motive is the desire for financial gain as an incentive in economic activity. Competition is a condition where different economic firms seek to obtain a share of a limited good by varying the elements of the marketing mix, price, product, promotion, and place. All right, so now some of you guys may be thinking, how does the role of the government play into economics? Well, the US government uses two types of policies, which are monetary policy and physical policy, which helps to influence economic performance. Monetary policy is defined as the policy adopted by the monetary authority of a country that controls either the interest rate payable on very short-term borrowing or the money supply often targeting inflation or the interest rate to ensure price stability and general trust in the currency. Physical policy is the use of government revenue collection and expenditure to influence a country's economy. Now that we have defined monetary policy and physical policy, now the question is, why are free market economies modified or mixed? Well, this permits private participation in production which in return allows healthy competition that can result in profit. It can also contribute to public ownership in manufacturing, which can address social welfare needs. And that's all you need to know. Goals of the free market system, which are economic freedom, voluntary exchange, private property rights, profit motive, and competition. Asking yourself, how does the role of the government play into economics? Defining monetary and physical policy and why are free market economies modified or mixed? This is AJ and the gang, signing off.